The detergent valve kit allows soap or detergent to be applied by your pressure washer. The valve opens when the pump is in low pressure operation. The black soap nozzle must be installed on the wand for the valve to open and allow detergent to flow. Over time, the valve can become clogged or stuck due to corrosion. Replacing the detergent valve is a repair that you can do yourself, and I'm going to show you how. Hi, I'm Mark Soja. Do-it-yourself repairs like these are easier than you might think. From lawn machines to cordless grills, kitchen mixers, outdoor grills, our how-to videos walk you through each repair from start to finish. So doing it yourself means never having to do it alone. Let's get started. I'll begin by removing the hose from the detergent valve. I'll use a pair of cutters to cut the hose free from the detergent valve stem and a knife to slice the remaining piece off. And now I'll cut the hose off of the filter and again remove the remaining piece. Now I can go ahead and remove the detergent valve from the pump. There's a plastic sleeve that's part of the detergent valve. It sits at the base of the opening in the pump. To remove it, I'll need to remove the screws that secure the pump to the engine. Then I can rotate the pump around so I have access to it. Now I can begin installing the new detergent valve kit. I'll start with the plastic sleeve, insert it into the pump, and I'll use a socket to slide it into place. Next I'll install the spring, then the ball bearing, and now the valve body and o-ring. A trick I like to use is to apply some grease to the o-ring. That'll allow me to stick it to the valve body and then I can thread this assembly back into the pump. I'll secure it with the wrench. And now I'll reattach the pump to the engine. Now I can reinstall the filter. And I'll install the other end of the tubing onto the detergent valve. And that's how you can install a new detergent valve kit in your pressure washer. Be sure to check back often for new videos and expert advice. If you found this video helpful, give us a thumbs up and leave a comment.